Hello, Kermit High School dual credit class for Government 2306. I'm Professor Young. Thought I'd shoot a, just a brief video this morning. Uh, sometimes it's nice to uh, put a face with a name. So anyway, um, I don't know the entire history of how we got where we're at here in mid-February, but this is where we are. So let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and make the best of it. So um, many of you may have noticed uh, that classes in, you guys can have access. I, I see some of you have, some of you haven't uh, granted access. So uh, uh, be sure to uh, talk it up if you guys know who else is in the class um, to make sure everyone's getting in on time. So I posted a orientation quiz yesterday. It's a real simple assignment. Uh, just basically all the answers are in the syllabus and you can retake it um, as many times as you like to get 100%. Uh, there's just one quick question I have to grade that asks for your phone number and then uh, or any best phone number to get a hold of you if, if the need should arise. Um, so please uh, take, be familiar with the class and then also get in the habit of checking constantly to make sure you're staying on task and um, have you received the emails. I don't know if you can, uh, you can go into your Odessa Outlook account and forward them if that's helpful to you, if you're not in the habit of, of checking your Odessa uh, email or your Odessa College email account. So uh, I implore you to do that or get in the habit of regularly, um, uh, regularly updating that. Another thing uh, for myself um, on my um, iPhone, you can easily add your Odessa account under your mail option. And so it's below my personal Gmail is my Odessa account. So I get a little notification every time there's an email from them. So uh, it's just a good habit to get into as you guys go into college anyway. Um, this is this is how colleges communicate is, is via email. So so make sure you're staying on task with that. Uh, so hopefully you, you had a chance to or get a chance to look at the class. Uh, uh, if you're not aware, there's no textbook for you to purchase. Uh, it's an ebook that we just linked to, and there's no uh, no charge or no registration to do that. And then uh, module one can go pretty quick. Uh, it's a discussion board, um, and I would say the things that probably uh, can affect people's grades is uh, just not completing all the items there and so uh you know in the discussions you know the uh, the big thing would be being, making sure you respond uh so this first one you know it says you need to respond to at least two of your classmates a minimum of 40 to 50 words and uh, make sure you use appropriate grammar uh, in, in general in college you need to always use uh correct grammar uh on everything from email discussion boards uh, but don't don't take the uh, idea that it's never uh, that it might not be important in some circumstances um, it's always a reflection of you and your capabilities so um, that would be my thing on the first one the module two gets a little more in depth so I would if I was you today take the orientation quiz uh, go ahead and complete module one it's not not that difficult and that'll give you some um, give you some time uh, built in you'll be uh, well ahead of schedule uh, but go ahead and read module two that's going to take a little bit of research on your part to help formulate your response so uh, anyway let's get off to a great start um, please work ahead don't fall behind uh, the entire class is open and so uh, you can I, I don't care how far ahead you work but don't miss deadlines um, it's uh, it's especially on things like discussions it, it kind of ruins the spirit of the assignment if people aren't getting them in on time then your classmates can't respond to them on time so let's make sure we get those things in early uh, once again i look forward to a great uh semester and uh, uh wish you guys all the best please feel free to email me anytime i'm really quick to respond and uh we'll we'll, we'll uh, enjoy this journey together have a great day